All right, hi. So we're going to jump right in. Sorry. Um, so I went to Home Goods and well, let me backtrack. Thank you for everyone who has subscribed, watched a video ever. Just thank you. And I just wanted to take time out to go ahead and say that. And I'm going to, sorry, adjust myself here. So I wanted to show you a few things that I've picked up recently over the last two weeks or whenever the last time I posted a haul video. So, um, someone asked me why I buy, um, similar items. Well, one, um, the items are in my style. So I buy things that I love and the items are going to maybe look similar to you or have the same feeling because it's my style. So I'm going to buy things that um, are my style and represent me. Second, I decorate in pairs, twos or threes, okay? Um, if not, yeah, most of the time it's two or three, right? So if you've ever looked at any of my tours of my living room or my tablescapes, you'll see similar items. So that's why I have more than one of the same item. And that's just, you know, my personal preference. So I picked up a tray. And this tray is a little bit different. So you're like, okay, what's going on here? I just wanted to show you guys that you can, um, it was $29.99. You can disassemble your tray and it's really easy. So depending on how many layers you have in your tray, you're able to kind of break it down. So you want to put your base first. Then you want to put, line it up, the hole in the base and the hole on the first level. And each of the like separating pieces have like screws. So you're just going to screw that in. I'm not going to screw in all the way because I'm... I'm not going to keep it like this. And you would screw it all the way in. And can you see that? So this tray looks like that. Now, some of you guys asked me how do I store some of my items, um, I'm still working on coming up with um, organizing my de uh, my decor. Still trying to find the best way I could do that, rather. So, um, with that being said, these trays you can break them down, and I would store it <laughs> like this if you don't have enough space to store them as is. So now I've taken something that was what 20 inches tall, 16, 20 inches tall, and now I've compacted to be the size of a tray. Now you know obviously the base piece is going to be pretty tall, but you probably will have more luck storing something of this size than to have the tall tray. Okay, so I just wanted to show you guys that and I also wanted to show you, I got another jewel tray, tear tray, um, just so I have similar items if I wanted to do a dessert um, table, a treat table, I would have two identical trays. So I got another one of the jewel, I'm not going to put this one together because it's the same, same method. So again... Take your time. You don't want to break any of your pieces. So you want to start at the base. Sometimes it's easier to screw off the base. And then that bottom level, the middle level, the top level. All right. So just do the same thing. So again, this was something that was really tall, right? And now we've compacted the size of the tray to be really small, right? And honestly, if you're not able to find jewel trays, you could use these as a tray. Now, obviously, there's going to be a hole in the middle, but 
you could use this as a tray and you could put you know little small items in here all right and this item for some reason some of these are defected um that are in home goods you can see there's some wear there but it's only really in that spot and some of the little diamonds are kind of you have to twist them around so remember the home goods I was telling you about I had the manager was kind of rude <laughs> well he redeemed himself this time so I don't know he must have had a bad day or a customer you know was rude to him or I don't know something but the day I went and I purchased this he was in a much better mood so I told him like hey this top layer is kind of wobbly I've tried to screw it back in and he's like yeah so he took a look at it and tried to see if he could tighten the um first layer and he couldn't as well so he ended up taking ten dollars off so I paid forty dollars for this tray All right, sorry. And I think this is the only thing I got from Burlington, kind of random. I got some coconut oil and it was $4.99. And I use this primarily to lock in moisture in my daughter's hair and as well as in my hair as well. Okay, so it's 100%. From Ross, I purchased Some of these candle holders. Sorry, hold on. So I think I'm going to put these in my daughter's room. But it kind of worked out perfectly because they had all three sizes, which you know, like instantly you're making a little vignette, right? Is that what it's called? Right? So it's kind of already coming together well. <laughs> Sorry for the paper. Am I too close? That, that just looks super good to me already. Maybe these two are the same size actually. So the smallest one was $8.99. The larger one $9.99 and $9.99. All right, so I just like how those looked and these are going to go in her room. Quick story, I filmed like my master bedroom, my um, daughter's nursery, even though she's not like an infant anymore, but it's still the nursery, her room. And the video came out super dark. I was so bummed out about that. So that's why you haven't seen that. It just looked horrible when I tried to lighten it, I tried to edit it, and it just, it wasn't working. So, that's what the delay is on that. It just was so dark. It looked horrible, and I knew I would have got, like, flack about it. So, I was just like, no. I have to refilm it. But her room is just dark in general. And I always try to do my home tours when it's really light outside. I mean, during the daytime, because I just feel like you should see the room in this natural Light. All right, so I ordered these off of Amazon, and they're just these, um, what are these little faux diamonds, crystals? So I thought these would look nice. Oh, let me bring them down here. Can you see them? So they're pretty large. They're a large size. So they came in this pouch here, and I think, I think there's fifty. I think there's 50 in here, but I just love these. They're really pretty. And they're $12.99 if I didn't say that already. All right, so from Ross also. Sorry, I need to move this stuff. So I had the wrong. Um, that day when I went to Ross, they had, I'm not going to say they had like a ton of things, but they had some good things that day because I haven't really been purchasing anything from Ross. So again, all right, tablescape. Why I buy pairs of things. So I have two of the larger ones, two of the smaller ones, or if you want to call them the medium ones. So if I'm doing a tablescape, right? 
Oh, I'm not even in focus here. I'm doing a table ski. I want to have symmetry. I want my left side and my right side to be symmetric. So imagine whatever I put in the middle, insert here, obviously be more space in between, but already I've kind of made a little, a little, what is this called? You know what I mean? So this is why I buy pairs because I mean, that would look awkward to me if I had something in the middle and just this one here, I need it to be symmetric on both sides. So the smaller ones were $8.99. And the larger ones were $9.99. And this is a different shape. So the other ones were kind of like this, these, this global, globe shape, not global. <laughs> and these are like, um, it's like a tulip shape, if you will. Okay. All right. So that's that. And the last thing, oh no, it's not the last thing, but, um, I also purchased this from, yeah, this is from Raw. So this is twelve ninety nine. It's a Yankee Candle and it's juicy ass and it smells, it smells good. So it's like berries. Yankee, they don't put their scent notes on the bottom. I think you could look them up online. But basically it smells like berries and fruit. Very fruity nice. So this one is a, I think it was 22, yeah, 22 ounce <clears throat> tumbler. Um, and it smells really good. So I thought this would be good for the summertime. And then this will look pretty in my living room. All right, moving along. Kind of random, but I'm going to put this in here. <laughs> I got some things for my daughter. So she had these shoes in gold last year. I'm sorry, I'm all over the place. And I thought these were really pretty. They're the next size up from now. So there's just these silver Rampage Girl Valley Flats. And they have these little silver flower matte glitter, matte glitter. And these were $8.99. And I just picked these up really quickly. And I got her some little... These are headbands. I thought they were clips, but I could still just like wrap them around her ponytails because, but in the summertime, I might let her wear her hair out a little bit more. And these were $2.99. And then I got some white flower. They have these gold little glitter um, mesh and pearls in the center. This one is a headband and these two are clips. And this was $2.99. I'm going quicker because I feel like <laughs> I don't want this to be forever. Oh, I meant to show you guys this. Did I show you this? No, I didn't. All right. Last tray, I promise. Don't be irked. <laughs> but I purchased the gold one. I purchased it because I think that I'm going to exchange the first gold one because this just looks higher quality to me. The smaller um, crystals and it just looks, it looks richer to me. Okay, it just does. And I like this one a lot better. Even though this one doesn't have the mirror. Oops, sorry. Doesn't have the mirror on the bottom. But yeah, I just like this one better. And again, these were $49.99. Okay. Also from... Home Goods. I purchased this mirror, mirrored clock, and this is gonna go on my. It's gonna go on my master, I think. And did I show you this already? Oh, I think I might have showed you this already. But no, I don't think I showed this to you. This was $12.99. I don't think I showed it to you, did I? No, I didn't show you guys that. Sometimes I get confused if I don't do my hauls right away, what I have showed you and what I have not showed you. 
and I'm gonna hurry up because I don't want to make a part two. All right, so I found these little crystal, not crystal, but these little mirror mosaic vases from Ross, and these were $3.99, and they matched. Remember, I showed you this in my last haul. Well, I found another one, and of course, I'm gonna use this for. Well, I'm not going to say just a tablescape, but for whenever, for whatever I decide to use it for, I'll have two and two. Okay. And again, $12.99 from Ross and $3.99. Okay. So someone had asked me or um not asked me but they had said they were a little bit um wishy-washy about ordering mirrored things online well <laughs> almost all of my large little accent pieces that are mirror I've ordered from primarily Amazon but I have purchased things from Wayfair and Overstock that are mirrored when people are shipping mirrored things they do try most places I'm going to say try to package them accordingly meaning they're not going to just have hazardly um package things that are mirrored because they don't want it to break I mean that's money that they're not going to that that, that, that that's excuse me that they will have to refund you so they'll lose out on money so it doesn't make any sense for them to package it in you know, a crazy way. So, all right, I ordered some chargers, four chargers. So, two came in a box. Two came in a box. So I had two boxes like this, right? I left it in a box so that you would see how it's packaged. So inside the box, there are two small white boxes like this. There's also where there's room on the end. Can you see that? They stuck this um, paper in and then on the other side they have styrofoam so the box won't shift as it's shipping. So each charger came in a, a box like this and then it was then placed in a plastic um sleeve so it was a plastic sleeve then put it into this box and then stacked and then they put the things on the side so that it wouldn't move around as it shipped all right so these are the plastic sleeves that was in sorry i didn't take it off because i wanted you to see how it was Packaged and I brought these. They're mirror chargers, sorry. And they're by Charge It by Jay. And I bought four. Did I only buy four of these? I think I'm gonna buy six, but I only bought four of them. And when I bought them, of course, I watched them. Anything on Amazon, you want to make sure you watch because prices will fluctuate. So <laughs> you want to make sure you buy them when they're as cheap as possible because, um, okay, so when I bought these, I think they were $15 and I went to check the prices on them today and they're about 35 or $38 and then the ones that I showed you like in my first couple hauls the mirror ones um, the mirror chargers and they had three um, rows of crystals those are still $38 and when I bought those chargers they were $10 a piece so of course I'm not gonna buy these at $38 because <laughs> that's double so no but for $15 I thought these were pretty. 
So they're mirror and they have these square, sorry, they have these square um, crystals on them here. And again, I have four and they're from Amazon. And, oh, kind of random. <laughs> I also bought um, the 10 foot iPhone chargers, cords, cable cords. And I think those are like $10 maybe. All right, so I needed some gold curtains for the black, white, and gold room. And I was looking online, looking online, and they do have some on Amazon, but the reviews are kind of bad. People that have purchased the gold color said that when they got it, it's more of a yellow. And I haven't found them anywhere else for a price that I want to spend. So I went to Walmart. <laughs> and I thought it was literally going to be like, um, I think it said a five piece set. Two curtains, a valance, and two tie pants. Two Tybex, excuse me. These came really quickly. However, <laughs> you see the backing? Yeah. Do you see this? This is one piece, y'all. One piece. Literally, one piece. One piece. The valance is attached to the curtain I'm like so you would have to keep it exactly like this you could never like open your curtains it's literally like two little strips of gold material it's super hard and crunchy oh, I'm sorry it feels like a shower curtain but do you see the top it's attached guys it's attached. I've never seen anything like this. It's all one piece. Like, and then I was like, well, I'll just take off. I'll just take off the valance. Well, let me tell you what they did. Well, actually, yeah. So this is the valance here and this is the curtain here. So they sandwiched the valance. Follow me. They sandwich the valance in between the little curtain. So I can't even take this off because this is the actual curtain piece in the middle, that short piece. So I need this loop for the curtains. So I don't know. I'll either just cut it here and then just get some um, iron on adhesive hem, whatever it's called, and just hem it and cut off the curtain. Or just look somewhere else. <laughs> and these were $15 from Walmart. But I cracked up so hard when I took this out the package. And it's all one piece. Literally. <laughs> okay. So that's it. And. Oh. Okay. Then I found this in Home Goods. It's right the sparkle for the black, white, and gold room. And this was um, can you see the little sparkle bits? That was sixteen ninety nine. Um, And I think last but not least, so I went to Home Goods. I think the last shot with me Home Goods. I saw this. No, I saw it like two shot with me Home Goods ago, and I didn't get it because I was like, uh, I'm not sure. But then I was like, I can get it because I could. I could potentially stack it on top of my um. My, I have the same one. Well, not the same one. But mine says, my, the current one I have says champagne. And I was like, oh, I could stack it on top of it. And I think they have another one that says fabulous. Or... No, no. I think they have one that says clink. 
So I'll have cheers, clink champagne, or champagne, clink cheers, or something like that. <laughs> but this was $16.99. And it's all glitter, glitterified. Yep, I just made that word up. But it's all super glittery and sparkly and nice, 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 nice. Okay. And sorry, I was trying to put something down. Um, I think the last thing. Oh no, I keep saying it. <laughs> So I also purchased this from Amazon and this, can you see it? So it's going to look like this here. This was $59.99 and um, I think I was expecting something taller, if that makes any sense. Let me see if I can take it out the box. Um... It's kind of not as tall. I mean, I looked at the dimensions, but I still thought it was going to be a bit grander than it is. So, yeah, it's all one piece. But this is what it looks like. Now, while it is pretty, um, yeah, it's pretty. It's pretty. I would be gra I would gravitate towards this if I seen it at Home Goods. I like how it's kind of different than. Well, I don't have anything that has three of the little crystal globes attached. It almost looks like a lighting fixture for a bathroom. <laughs> Random, but yeah, I'm pretty sure someone will find a way to like if you wanted to make it a light fixture, you could. But that's kind of cool. But um. Yeah, so this was from Amazon and it was $59.99. Okay, so I was so excited when I seen this. I was in Home Goods, just minding my business, pushing my cart around, and to my surprise, out the corner of my eye, I'm walking down the aisle. I'm like the home decor aisle and then I see like where they have like the the wall decor I see bling I see bling I see sparkle so I'm like oh my gosh oh my gosh so I push my cart super quick to the area and I find I find this and then as I'm looking and I get closer there are two of these so of course I bought two because one just would not make the impact that I would want it to make. So I would definitely, I'm on the lookout for another one because again, three of these, one, two, three, will look really nice. And even if I hung it horizon horizontally, I would still do three because you need that effect. Like it's, I don't, I don't know, I would anyway. I would stack it one, two, and then the third one on top. But this was, let's see if you can, if I can bring it closer, $27.99. And it's as wide as my, um, as the Pier 1 decorative panels. But it is not as tall as the Pier 1 decorative panels. It's about 8 inches shorter. <clears throat> But this was super nice for under $60 to so find two of these. I mean, that would just look so awesome somewhere. Just silver and blingy. And it's not like super shiny silver. It's kind of like, it's kind of like tarnished. Not tarnished, but it's not really like sparkly, sparkly silver. If that makes any sense. <laughs> but yeah, I was so happy. This was definitely like what I was happiest to buy. But thanks for watching. I know it's a long video. I appreciate everyone who has subscribed, who has watched the video, liked the video, 
and or share one of my videos. I appreciate you. And if you haven't subscribed yet, I would like it a lot if you were able to. And also, if you want to get notifications when I upload a video, go ahead and hit the bell next to the subscribe button. And I will see you all soon. Bye.